Hi, I am Siti Nushapika and in this StratCam video, I'm going to teach you how to calculate activation energy. So we have a question here. The question said that the red constant for the reaction below is 0 0.0234 per second at 400 degrees Celsius and 0 0.750 per second at 500 degrees Celsius. So, it asks to calculate the activation energy in kilojoule per mole. So, we have given the balance equation here. So, N2O gas plus with NO gas producing N2 gas plus NO2 gas. So, we have the delta H given. So, from the delta H given, we know that when it is negative, it is exothermic reaction. Exothermic reaction. So, extract all the information from these questions. So, I have listed down the information here. So, from this information, I know that I should use this equation in order to get the activation energy I use these equations to get the activation energy so substitute all the value into the equations and use your calculator to use to calculate all of this so in the end we will get 150.03 kilojoule per mole so this is the activation energy. The activation energy that we calculate here is the activation energy for forward reactions. So, after we calculate that, next the question asks for us to draw a label energy profile diagram for the reaction and also we have to calculate the activation energy for the reverse reaction. So, first, We have to know what shape of energy profile diagram that we're gonna sketch from the reaction from the enthalpy that given in here we know when it is negative we have exothermic reaction so the shape of the profile energy um, energy profile diagram sorry energy profile diagram supposed to be like this you have here higher and you have a bump here and then over here yes it must be lower than the reactant and then that is our shape for energy profile di profile diagram for exothermic and then second you have to label axis Rectin and product. So here axis should be labeled as potential energy and here is reaction progress. We have to label the axis and here and here supposed to be your reacting and here supposed to be your um, product so from the equation given here here this is your reacting this is your reacting and this is your product this is product this is reacting so cheers Level here and to all gas plus with and all gas. And here your product and two gas plus with and all two gas. And then You have to level your activation energy. Don't forget to do a dotted line here. Over here. Um, a dotted line that um, 
same level with your reacting and also your product so your activation energy level from the top of the bump until to the dotted line of your reacting that is your activation energy which is equals with with the amount that we get is just now that we calculate 154.03 kilojoule per mole and you have to level your enthalpy change enthalpy change here from the first dotted line to the second dotted line so enthalpy change we have provided that in the questions which is negative 110 kilojoule per mole so this is our level energy profile diagram for exothermic reaction so we're done for that so next the questions ask for us to calculate the activation energy for the reverse reaction so for reverse reaction to find reverse reaction activation energy for reverse reaction we have the formula as ea reverse equals to ea forward minus with delta h so ea forward that we calculate here this is ea forward so we have it as 150.03 kilojoule per mole minus with um, our delta H is negative 110 negative 110 kilojoule per mole so we can have it our EA reverse activation energy reverse is positive 260 kilojoule per mole 